causing us to take care of you and your loved ones. We are so lucky you drive our desires to do better and to get us into work each day. While obviously we have met all of our patients, we haven't always met family members, so I would ask you to please make yourselves known to us, especially where you are here representing a loved one who is no longer with us. We will endeavour to remember everyone, but we may need just a little help. Our wonderful catering team have organised a fabulous spread of tea, coffee and nibbles in the parish centre, and we would love you to share a cuppa and a chat. I would like to take this opportunity to thank sincerely Father Paul Churchill and his parish team for extending the hand of friendship and allowing us to avail of this beautiful church and facilities. I also need to thank sincerely Father Liam Murta, who has been with us, well with me personally, for the last 21 years in the Matter Private Hospital. And he has, he, has con he has celebrated and con celebrated several of these masses over the years always with a cheeky glint in his eye. <laughs> I am not going to get to thank everyone as we would be here all night, but just want to say a quick thanks to my partners in crime, the whole Cancer Services team, Catherine Glover-Brown, Jane O'Neill, Father Peter Murphy, and of course, the Matter Private Hospital Choir. We wish you all a happy, safe, and peaceful Christmas and best wishes for 2024. Thank you. And just in case you're wondering where the parish centre is, it's in Nelson Street, 21 Nelson Street. You'll note there's uh, railings around it, and there's, even in the dark you can see, I think you can see the palm trees. So that might help you find it. And just, if you have your back to the main General Martyr Hospital looking down Nelson Street, it's on the right-hand side, um, not too far from Eccles Street. So I hope that helps you get there. And on my own behalf and the people of the parish to thank you very much for choosing here to have this celebration. And as I said, I think we're all inspired by the work you do. And I've always been um, touched by the friendliness of the staff whenever I've had to go over to you. So I wish you all a very happy Christmas and a blessed 2024. Thanks. Thanks, Father Paul. And again, thank you to the parish team. You've made it very special with your warm welcome. And I can't not again mention the music group, the choir from the Matter Private Hospital, because I've witnessed them. I've tried to tap my toe and sing along, particularly every Tuesday evening. I feel guilty as I'm going home. They're moving into the oratory and practicing. And as I've said before, uh, if they had CDs, we'd give them out to everybody, but um, we don't yet. And I would always say we can't afford them. And they're, they're members of staff, again, in the interdisciplinary model, who you probably know in different circumstances, maybe wearing scrubs and different uniforms, and some not in uniform, but name badges, definitely. Uh, so they're, they're all uh, team members right across the matter of private hospital, and uh, we can only express our gratitude with an applause, but we deserve to get their autographs, and we can't, we can't afford them. So now lo looking forward to meeting everybody in the Paris Centre and wishing each of you and your loved ones peace and as many joys that are possible and solidarity at all times. And you won't be forgotten in our prayers and our hearts in the remaining days of Advent, in Christmas time as it comes the 12 days and in the year ahead. The Lord be with you. May God the Father bless you. May God the Son heal you. May God the Holy Spirit guide you always and lift your worries and fears and assure you of God's love and care, a care and love you radiate yourselves, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace, glorifying the Lord by your life. Thanks, Thanks be to God. To God.